Welcome back. Thanksgiving is next week and the day is typically filled with lots of food and gatherings, but our sunny side reminds us to keep our furry friends in mind during the holiday. It's so tempting to share the holiday spirit with your pets and feed them what you're cooking. But what you eat may not be good for your smaller companions. You want to be especially careful. We've got special foods in the house right now, uh, but especially if you're having turkey or ham or anything that might have a bone in it. Uh, of course, a dog might love a bite of turkey, but you want to make sure that there are no bones. You want to make sure that that's, that's a huge choking hazard for them. She says if your pets are not used to eating table scraps, the holiday season is probably not the right time to experiment. Um, onions, mushrooms, grapes. Um, anything that might cause your pet to have a reaction. Um, and of course, it, no plan is completely safe. And so it may happen, your pet may accidentally have one of those items that's not good for it. Um, in which case we do recommend going ahead and contacting your local vet and saying, hey, what are your holiday hours gonna be? Um, and if your vet's not going to be open for emergencies over the holidays, you might want to go ahead and ask what they recommend for a local emergency vet. Despite the excitement of the holiday season, Aguiland Humane Society always sees a small uptick in missing pets afterwards. The shelter says to be aware of when your doors are opening and closing, and if your pet has a tendency to run out, to always keep them in a room behind a closed door. If they do get out, you want to make sure you can go ahead and start posting on social media. Uh, uh, checking your both local animal shelters here at Aggie Land Humane and the Bryan Animal Center. We both post uh, missing pets online. Uh, so as soon as that pet comes into our shelter, we're going to have a photo and a little description online for you. Mackenzie reminds you if your pet is not yet microchipped, now is the perfect time to do so. In College Station, Sunny Side, KAX News. Thank you, Sunny. Aggie Land Humane Society says pets could react to something they eat for up to two days. I know. I've been there with my dog before, so be sure to keep a close eye on your pet if they eat something they shouldn't.